it's a I call it the guide to solving the energy puzzle, actually. So uh, it's a prescription, right? Yeah, same thing that you'd get, and that's a great uh, analogy there with the doctor, going in and finding the issues, doing a uh, evaluation, doing a customer interview, and then actually doing some diagnostic testing with equipment to identify air leakage in the home and uh, infrared scan. So it's a it's a it's visual. It's getting information from the consumer because they're living in the home, right? Mm-hmm. They actually have the information that you need, and then you're validating it by doing the testing. That's super important. And then putting together a report that actually gives them a score. So it tells them how their house ranks in regards to homes that are built in, in different eras. For instance, an Energy Star home, it will rank them uh, where it shows them where they stand. And then based on the improvements, the recommendations, it then gives them a score and tells them what their energy consumption can be lowered to. You know, we did the energy saving makeover back in 2011. Yeah. The audit predicted a 61% savings. We're tracking well over 68% now. That's so incredible. That, that's pretty accurate when you when it comes to the audit. The audit's always conservative. So we see many, many people that get an energy audit that just based on the recommendations that we find – based on that particular house, the yep. testing and everything, they'll get a 30% reduction in energy. But as important as that is, which is super important, they also will achieve comfort. Most all the time, you know, they'll save money in certain aspects of that, but it, achieving a comfort level that they're, they've never found before because air moving into a home is a real problem. If you had water coming in through around your doors and windows and, and every place else, you'd see it. You'd do something about it, right? It would be immediate. You, you wouldn't even think about it. You'd go, oh, my God, I need to stop the water from coming in. But when air's coming in, you can't see that. You can, though, if you see dust if you have high humidity issues, if you have uncomfortable rooms, that's air moving in almost always into the home that should not be moving in.